welcome to another ride along with goggles and um, today we're in Farmington New Mexico and we've got the Pizder and Demo um, 389 here um, got a 379 grill shell on it though <laughs> and uh, some custom headlights uh, and we got the the uh, now I'm not sure if the trailer is out yet or not I'll have to check but this is the uh, Wade step deck from Pizder as well and uh, it's got a few new options here uh, the uh, toolbox by the landing gear there and the one underneath in the middle seem to be new and uh, yes yeah, looking pretty sharp <laughs> and um, uh, what we're gonna do here is uh, I'm gonna change the path so let's go to the world map instead of going all down here in this boring road we're gonna go in this road and you can see we've done it in the other direction uh, we're gonna go from west to east this time so let's um let's just do that there we go wow it's exactly the same distance no 333 343 oh yeah okay so it takes 10 miles off but it's a little slower but we're not in a hurry so uh let's uh let's get on with it and the other so what's been somebody uh commented I think I've had a couple comments where people say uh, they're not seeing the paint job on the hood of the truck when I have the uh, black swan paint job on the uh, Pizzer 389 and I don't know I'm seeing the paint job so that's part of the reason we're in this truck I just wanted to check it out and then I thought well I'm here well darn better just drive the <laughs> drive it because I really like it it's a great truck and uh, and also uh, the these guys are awesome. Like uh, as far as uh, just gonna make it around there. Yeah, trying to get enough room to get around the right here. Um, they support guys like me and recon and recon by making uh, mods and things he can put in his map and uh, me by supporting my discord's uh, Turn left. monthly photo contest with a giveaway of uh, a trailer pack which is pretty darn nice so hats off to them and uh, very happy uh, with how they support the community after 100 yards which reminds me, so today is the 31st of May. Turn right. June, June 1st as you watch this. And uh, yeah, last day of the May photo contest today. It's always, uh, you know, tomorrow I'll, I'll look at the uh, um, entries and tabulate for the winner. But boy, the guy sure takes some good photos. Got a uh, DD60 in here. see if we got the big oh I don't think I have oh no I don't have JBX running in this profile it's funny how that's so hit and miss I still haven't done a deep dive into it to see what goes on and all I've done is you know compare two profiles 
and I'm kind of starting to think it might depend where you are in the map. I don't know. It just seems really strange. But yeah, I don't know. I see the paint on the hood just fine, so I wonder what uh, is going on with those other fellas. I got to make sure that was the actual complaint, but I think that's what they're saying. And they hopped in the truck. They didn't see the paint on the hood. Oh, hey there, Sporto. Can't see that light lasting till we get there. No. Hey, the bus is turning. But yeah, this is quite a truck. Cargo is uh, JCB mini excavators. Oh darn! You're gonna get stuck behind this guy. I guess I should have stepped on it a little harder, but uh, hopefully, when we turn right, he goes left up here. Yeah, there's not a lot of um, call to go this route that we're taking here, so it's kind of nice to uh, find a load that we didn't have to do much other than just you know, redirect ourselves. I think other times I've wanted to take this road, I've used Truckee. I didn't need to use it today. fast up there. Isn't that a kicker, eh? You get over the hill and, and they slow it down to 45. Oh, yeah, so uh, they'll try and uh, at the end of the video, we'll see what we're doing for time. 
time keep one eye on it. I'd like to show you, uh, well maybe I'll just make another video, but Recon is working on a, a shop uh, in, um, where do you put it, uh, Amarillo. And uh, he's going to put uh, some form of a goggles name on it, which is kind of cool. So we'll see what he ends up with. Should be pretty neat. Man, I wish I could get around this guy. Smart the dash. Yeah, we don't have a turn off coming anytime soon. Here's our Keep turn. Right. After turn. 50 yards, turn right. After all that, he's... Turn right. Watch him pull up in the left lane. Oh no, he was going this way, so I guess it was a good move. Left turn coming up here. Yeah, here it comes. And this is a road that, uh, like I say, uh, I don't. I think the only scheduled traffic yards, turn left. I've ever had on it was a uh, special transport. Nice light load, 19,000 pounds. traffic. Darn it.
a ski hill in the distance, it looks like. What if that's what that is? Sure looks like it. Oh, maybe not. Maybe it's just a road going up there. Yeah, probably just a road. Oh, shoot. Forgot to jump out and look at that cool uh, canyon. Oh, we're going to crash it. <laughs> uh. Oh yeah, we've got a few new uh, patrons, which is kind of cool. i got to update the patron page. Hopefully I have it done for this uh, video. Um, once again, I'm doing this one in the AM, so I can get out and work in the garage as soon as I'm done recording this, but hopefully I can update the patron page. Yeah, so Grey Dog is uh, one of them, and I really appreciate that Grey Dog, it's awesome. Yeah, the other new patron, uh, I'm a little unclear on the username I should be using, so I'll figure that out before I announce who they are, just in case I mess that up. button's not working again. I guess that's a news flash, eh? <laughs> it's not going to get any better till I change it. Oh boy, look at this road coming up. Pretty scenic. Yes, it's quite a road to do uh, the special transport on. that uh, 
cement mixer up ahead is right on the tail of the vehicle in front of it. Yeah, that's kind of odd because you'd think the, the lighter vehicle would just be off and running on this road. And the cement mixer wouldn't be able to keep up. Oh, he's got a little distance there now. Alright, here we come into this little town. Eagle Nest. The, uh, I think it's the Ugly Coyote Hotel up ahead. Man, two traffic lights. Big town. I grew up in a town with, well, not even in the town, a mile away. A town with no traffic lights. We didn't shake that uh, little flat deck up ahead. Here's the Ugly Coyote Hotel. I think, oh, freaking Coyote, that's what it is. <laughs> Ugly Coyote. <laughs> I don't know where I got that from. It's funny that uh, Jake button, sometimes it's pretty reliable and other times it isn't. I guess what I should do, like I got a little, like I think I mentioned before, a little bag of buttons and uh, came from Amazon and you know, it's, I got them all over the dash here and some of them seem to be pretty good and some are pretty bad, so real hit and miss, so what I should do is um boy i'm sure I'm missing the gears uh this one right here and the one on the jake i gotta change them what i should do is not pull any more out of that little bag and find a different source for a better button pain in the neck to change this one because i'm gonna have to pull everything well, I'll have to take the dash so I can get at it properly. Uh, take the uh, dash off of the uh, unmounted from here. It's bolted down pretty good. I got it bolted down with four, four bolts in the back. It's pretty rigid. It's on there pretty good. 
but I guess you gotta do what you gotta do. Question of time. Um, photo <laughs> as we leave the scene of the crash or the accident. Well, I could think nobody was coming. the hilly section. After 100 yards, turn left. There goes that guy. Turn left. Earnhardt trailer again. Guess we're taking the next exit, it looks like. Yeah, I think what we'll do, I, I don't know, uh, pending Exit right ahead. updates by Recon on his, uh, that new garage, whatever he does uh, for the for the next video, which I guess is going to be Friday's video, I'll try and start it there, give you a look at it. It's pretty cool, though. place. Yeah, it looks like it. triple. Got that site there. That's not where we're going. We're going to the big plant, I guess. Oh, well, that's a... That looks like a plaster in sense. Yeah, it is. This will be where we're heading. Nice location. 
after 100 yards, turn right. So I'm using the default wheels this time on the uh, trailer. I just put uh, Smarties uh, hubs right. and hubcaps on it and, and lug nuts. As uh, previously, I was using Smarties wheels and the uh, 22.5 tra uh, tires from Retro. But. Uh, you have reached your destination. Didn't go far enough here. Oops. Try forward. There we go. Where do they need it? Oh, way in the back. It's funny you don't get a license plate on this trailer. That's pretty nice. what we're doing here. Uh, how long are we? We are pretty long. Are we going to get in there to turn around? I don't think so. I think what we should do is try and turn around right here. Uh, we may... Yeah, it may come in too far. Oh, uh, well do what we can do. We're going to have to uh, do a little bit of a do -si do here. A little bit of old high speed reverse. I can't stay in there too long though, because it's really hard to catch up to what you're supposed to be doing. Okay, that's enough of that. <laughs> that's just reverse and high range. this parking job. Oh, it gave it to us. Oh, we'll straighten it out a bit because we got pride. A little bit of pride in what we do. back right through it. Oh, it's giving it to us again. <laughs> Should be able to get it this time. There. It's a nice drive. <laughs> I always enjoy that. So let's uh, get the lights off. Brakes are on. Get this thing unloaded. Boy, we used a lot of fuel. Oh, 
I didn't I didn't fuel up before uh, we went. That's what happened. We only used 63 gallons. And uh, yeah, nice drive. As I already said. And uh, yeah, I don't know what the issue is with the paint job. Some of the folks are seeing where they don't see the uh, paint on the hood. I don't quite get that. So I don't know. Maybe comment if you're one of the folks who's having a problem and let me know what's going on. Or did I not test it right? Or what's what's the scoop there? I wouldn't mind an update because it's, it's been in the back of my mind for a while. And I finally got into the truck to see what's going on. And maybe I'm not looking for the right problem. So anyway, let me know. And uh, take care, guys. And we'll catch you on the next one. Bye for now.